Hi, in this video we'd like to talk about the relationship between PCOS and recurrent miscarriage. Now, as we all know, PCOS is caused by the presence of abnormal testicular tissue that is not supposed to be there, but these women end up being born with it. And over time, when they develop during their puberty, they experience high testosterone levels and end up developing physical symptoms such as excessive facial and body acne that doesn't go away and also excessive body hair, obesity, rough and dark skin and they also end up developing some form of emotional instability all tied into the high testosterone levels as well. So another thing that these women experience is that if they do end up getting married and then beginning pregnancy is that they will experience pregnancy failures on repeat because although they have no trouble getting pregnant there is no infertility here it will lead to very short-term pregnancies because first of all these follicles that are released from the ovaries are not well developed causing them to break down very quickly and also can cause several abnormalities uh, within the deceased fetus as well whenever we do some post miscarriage analysis we will find out there's some form of chromosomal abnormality trisomy some abnormality that is uh, clearly linked to the PCOS which is why you need to seek treatment furthermore these patients these PCOS patients 50% of them are actually uh, having another underlying condition alongside this PCOS which is uterine malformations so the common ones that we observe are septate uterus and naive uterus some of them even develop cervical insufficiencies as well because these two conditions are tied in together they come together as a package which is why a thorough diagnosis is required to treat both individual conditions so if these patients even if they do manage to sustain the pregnancy because of the presence of the septate the naive uterus it will lead to another short-term pregnancy as well and has a chance to lead to an ectopic pregnancy as well which can lead to complications such as uh, removal of the fallopian tubes as well and that is something that we want to avoid because now it's become a condition where you still are able to get pregnant and end up you become absolutely infertile because of the removal of the fallopian tubes these are all very possible and we all deem these as high-risk pregnancies so at Anti hospital uh, we offer you highly effective thorough comprehensive diagnosis and treatment for your underlying condition that has led to miscarriages so clearly PCOS has uh, been affecting your pregnancy and if you do diagnose a presence of a uterine malformation we will also need to uh, recommend a uterine corrective surgery as well uh, once we do both treatments at the same time so you do not need to go for multiple procedures and that as well we can offer you entire treatment uh, together and also this surgery is conducted minimally invasive via 3d laparoscopy so there's no scarring there won't be any post uh, operative adhesions as well because we are using our anti-patented uh, intrauterine stent to maintain the uterine shape and size and also we have our bio adhesion barrier that can promote recovery and also prevention of any scarring and adhesions and once you are fully recovered you can go on to conceive and achieve pregnancy without any complications now that is our guarantee that we offer you and it comes with a full refund guarantee as well if you're still miscarrying or you see repeated pregnancy failures we are obligated to return you the entire treatment cost so do get in touch with us via the website as soon as you can let's set up a consultation and let's discuss how we can help you in your fertility journey today